the uh, like two string to I think the musical string we talked about the uh, the character about the happy and about the music things we talked about try to remember so the silk string how to make it use the kind of this twist thing you know this twist things right the twist thing so this is the like the silk twist thing and uh, um, so two of them uh, for the walking walking style uh, the mountain part stay the same but the more kind of the connected and uh, only uh, simplify the uh, silk twist part uh, kind of omit this dot and uh, so this to this directly go this one again but this one you can do a little bit of back thing shows the difference and the connect with the uh, next stroke you know something like that just put in more connect and uh, the silk twist part a little bit you know go faster and uh, uh, put them like a two of them a little bit connection in between and the first without kind of this dot the very 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 I mean logical yeah something like that um, and the horizon I mean the uh, cursive one you know, almost the same, I would say, more connection in the two silk, part, silk uh, twist part um, and uh, like a more connection for the mountain part, the bottom mountain <clears throat> part. But I'm glad you still can tell that's the, that's the mountain. Very good because we reviewed again and again. So um, let's see, right, this part. <clears throat> so um, become faster but at the end normally we want to do things um, when um, I saw your homework sometimes I say you know I want to show some you know the power things and also the tendency of uh, uh, going ready for the next characters, right? So do not just sweeping it. Yeah, something like that. Okay, so then you can do um, like the secluded something, secluded. Uh, do you use the secluded, secluded for this kind of thing, secluded uh, fragrant, or is it secluded fragrant, or we call the orchid because in the mountain area grow like a wild, uh, they like the natural, natural atmosphere fair, uh, and uh, we call it um, like a seclu uh, secluded uh, orchid. <laughs> See these kind of things. Right? Secondly, the orchid, or uh, to remember the word for fragrant, uh, sweet smelling, smells good, we call the we call that kind of the, uh, I mean, the smelling, the aroma, the fragrance, also we call the um, secluded uh, fragrant. Yeah, you can do that. <coughs> so that, that term would be yaw for the secluded and what's the 
fragrant is Shang. Yes. Yeah, yes. Shang. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Very good, Charlene. You learned the, the sound as well. <laughs> right. trying, to, trying to get it. <laughs> good. Uh -huh. no, it's kind of pretty, really. <laughs> yes, as uh, and uh, if you can see the mountain there, I think as uh, can kind of uh, uh, um, there is something to do with the meaning. You know, easier to remember it, and uh, you look at oh, something in the mountain is secluded. <laughs> well, you so, know, even the hermits were secluded in the mountain too. Right? Okay, you call it it is a hermit of, in the flower family things. Uh -huh. <laughs> Not okay. so fragrant, probably. <laughs> right, right, right. It's actually very, 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 very fragrant. Just the kind of the far from the um, the people lived from, uh, and you can bring it to the very fragrant. Actually, we have I the. Just, I just, I just meant the hermit probably wasn't so. Fragrant. Oh, oh, I understand. I talk about that. I'm going to see what kind of we can do for the orchids and I will do very simple orchids and put this uh, yo, the uh, secluded orchid um, on that. Um, let's see. I will do some ink one. If you want to do some, uh, I will do the colorful one for the uh, next uh, uh, flower one. And today I'll try to want to do this secluded one and uh, just use ink. If you want to do color, you can use color. No problem. And the calligraphy uh, secluded orchid, you can do the, uh, of course, ink black. Yeah, recent I tried the sized paper. Uh, I think I would do the some rock first. Oh, I don't really mind though. what is it, the rock. And uh, some orchid here. What do we can use? <laughs> like Kathy said, if it was this, I use my left hand, it actually easier. <laughs> Because wild things is beside of the rock, probably <clears throat> something really, you know, like an old stock. No people trim it, right? So something really hard. Many grows here. Some flower, do I want some light one here? Okay, some flower, flower bud. And the flower here. You can do some different widths of the flower, some narrow, some shorter, and the one here. And the stem. Mm. 
not very important. And uh, actually, the flower is supposed to be really light, but I used the same brush and the dot, the, the center put the dot. <clears throat> And uh, where's place? I think I want to write things here. And uh, then my name and the uh, seal for that. I didn't bring it to the desk, I forgot. <laughs> um, anyway, um, you know, the early, earliest, um, uh, like the orchid um, be, um, how to say, okay, the Confucius, you are, uh, everybody knows the Confucius, right? Confucius first, uh, remember, I mean, the, um, write things and they say some, say some things about the, uh, the orchid, the, uh, the orchids, um, and then lots of, uh, like the, um, in lots of the poem and the poetry, uh, like to um, give them lots of, uh, good uh, symbolic, uh, first things I think I want to say the for the Confucius, you know, Confucius in the uh, I think 500 to 600 BC, and uh, he tried to um, uh, give the give her thought and her um, uh, his uh, suggestion about the his uh, what's it the uh, benevolent governance to the uh uh government um says no no wall uh no um nothing else but concentrate on these kind of things and concentrate on the education when people are uh, all educated they will become good <laughs> you know like that and that uh, no people uh, so that meant that, that by that time, uh, lots of uh, countries and uh, always want to, you know, fight each other and uh, or uh, nobody uh, listened to his um, suggestion, appreciated him and, uh, uh, and the Confu uh, Confucius um, even traveled to other um, um, small countries around his country to um, tell them um, his thought, his philosophy, and then nobody want to, nobody listen to him, and then nobody want to um, uh, appreciate um, his thought to hire him <laughs> or do some things. And uh, when he, he got very disappointed, very disappointed, um, and when he uh, uh, go back to his country and uh, down the mountain road, he saw some orchids and uh, he suddenly realized things um, like the orchids there are oh, all no people, uh, no people know them, and uh, they are they are they are here. Uh, be themselves, um, bloom, and uh, frag uh, very fragrant, very fragrant. So um, nothing. If no people get the flower, know the flower, appreciate the fragrant. No people know it. And the what's wrong? What's heard with the um, orchids themselves? Um, they still um, be themselves, bloom and the fragrant. <laughs> uh, and so uh, it's something like the um, uh, for the uh, for the orchids, like the um, later other. Han Yu, another um, poet, poet say, uh, says, Bu Cai Er Pei.
Yu Lan He Shang. And Henry, probably you help me to uh, put on the, the computer to type out. This is the other part. It's Han Yu's. And the Confucius just write some uh, some things to say, uh, Shang Bu Feng Shi Ji Lan Zuo Cao. Okay, and also this um say um bu cai er pei uh yu lan he shang which we 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 which means um won't hurt if somebody uh for the won't hurt for the some uh for uh uh the orchids in even though nobody to pick me up and uh uh to appreciate the fragrance and put on the head and pay me uh whereas on some some somewhere on on your clothing uh to appreciate me to appreciate the flowers, but the flower orchids myself is here. I'm here, it's still blooming for myself, be myself, blooming and uh, fragrant. <laughs> and also I think uh, uh, something says, um, after, the, uh, after that it also says, Junzi means uh, gentleman. Uh, which means uh, gentlemen, gentlemen, if got um, got hurt or no people appreciate, you know, um, gentlemen got hurt, uh, but the gentlemen, gentlemen need to um, to keep to maintain their um, personal um, integrity. Understand, uh, understand the the yeah my my English. Uh, so that's why uh, people later on, um, and we have lots of uh, like poetic poetic things uh, to a uh, phrase to admire the um, orchids and do lots of orchid painting and put some calligraphy on that and give the meaning of the. Uh, the symbolic meaning of that gentleman. That's why orchids become gentlemen. <laughs> so Confucius, uh, when he, when he back and saw that first, put some things and later on like, lots of things. So gentlemen, um, um, and uh, I I I think I put this with the with the with the rock and the behind behind the rock. So kind of the uh, secluded <laughs> and. Uh, I don't know, Confucius walked here <laughs> and uh, first uh, uh, not very um, be uh, attracted by the, you know, like the peony style, the very colorful thing, but later uh, found this and uh, smelled the fragrant and uh, thinking about the things uh, about the, his life, <laughs> his situation and uh, put the, you know, the symbolic of the gen gentleman's things. Yes, we like it. It is very, very, uh, very uh, elegant looking, and uh, you know, like my orchids, my orchids. You know, our our temperature right now is one o two today and one o five tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Um, so it's blooming. Can you think of that? And uh, last, my last one, I bring them. I brought them to the class twice, right? So two weeks. You know my rose in my garden. My rose uh, in my garden, uh, like perfect flower. Two days and the jasmines. Two days for the flower. Two days, but the orchids. Two weeks. Um, yeah, it's a slow but very, actually very tough. But of course they have their their own. Uh, 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 I mean, things they like. They don't like the directly sunshine. You know that things like or. Uh, yeah, so, 
any question, you can do any on the colorful one or do any, I'm just do, think it's fun to do some just the choreography strokes <laughs> and uh, to, uh, yeah, to um, share some things about the um, first like a record of the Confucius stories about the orchids uh, in his way back feel disappointed to nobody appreciated uh, his, he think is correct things, but lots of people think, oh, in that time, um, uh, people want to, um, government want to do some fire, you know, in the fi fighting, fighting things, a uh, wall and uh, to other uh, countries and the people think besides that, what's important? Okay. Uh, some people said economics, of course, economics is important. So no people think of education, you know, people be educated are important. So uh, they do not think, they didn't think the Confucius uh, philosophy, Confucius things are practical. So nobody appreciated him <laughs> and uh, he just tried to adjust the mood <laughs> and uh, uh, continue to be gentleman and uh, got inspired <laughs> of the orchids down the road and you know. Um, yeah, any question at the, uh, I think next time we'll do some colorful one, but yeah, recently I think for this uh, orchid season, we do like a one character or, uh, you know, some choreography uh, drawing painting of the orchids. Uh, any, any question of your painting actually? Uh, for do that. I think you can do colorful painting. Uh, some people like uh, doesn't want the black one, the ink one. And, uh, but for the colorful one uh, painting, and then you do some, uh, you know, black uh, characters put on that will, you know, make the whole thing uh, kind of very, very uh, complete, very completed. <laughs> Even like uh, um, for um, some like some clothing or some design, very colorful, but with a little bit, you know, the black the black shows a little a little bit somewhere. It it will, I I think it will beautiful for me. Uh -huh. But so uh, we try to learn some uh, useful practical word, good word. Um, as calligraphy writing to put on your painting, you know. So uh, try to put them together. I think since we learned the calligraphy for a while and uh, put the calligraphy uh, writing, I thought um, Emily does that and Kathy does that as, as well. Yeah, it's good, very good practicing. Um, and for this or orchids, I think um, I tried to do some, I saw, um, see, we always, um, you know, appreciate, you know, some press and lift, press and lift and um, make some crossing, some crossing things. And we say, uh, make the phoenix, phoenix eye, right? Makes phoenix eye. And some crossing is we call the breaking the phoenix eye. So those are the very, very basic uh, crossing role, just easier to remember. And then and the other growth, you know, other growth added, but still, you know, Some eyes, some eyes there, and based on these kind of things, yeah. some orchids are very, um, very, very outside the old one, very straight, and some young one, tender one, are very straight. 
and some old one, middle aged one, can be very long. Some are very curvy, and some are straight. I mean, sometimes depend on different orchids. And uh, but eventually, for the whole thing, we want to see some you know secret. We we talked about always always see some you know cup of eye eye there, which means the role of how do you crossing it right? How to crossing? Uh -huh. How do you cross? And some eye, but not too big eye, you know, sometimes can be very close. Do it on purpose to do the eye. When you do the practice, you can do that. Uh -huh. And then later you get used to that. So uh, stroke after stroke, you do that very naturally. Mm -hmm. And the bring- Vic Victoria? Yes. Victoria, I have a question yes. for you yes. and Henry. Okay. Um, just now I just threw away one because I tend to commit this error. I'm going to show it to you. Uh -huh. I cross and make a chicken foot and that's unconsciously. So I just got it when I saw it and I threw it away immediately because I said this is a no no. Mm. So how can you, um, you know, um, not do this? You have to be really conscious for uh, for this not to happen because it happens to me quite often. Oh really? You know? Yeah. Okay. It's Susan's yeah. Susan's Susan's question because we have the taboo of uh, uh, when you cross right when you cross this is the eye right this is the, uh, the eye I just did mm -hmm. even very small right the cross and the breaking breaking the eye you know some natural. It's, it's beautiful already, uh, this kind of the combination is correct. But it's very, uh, Susan says, do the taboo of the tide, three of them, you know, this kind of things. This kind of things, mm -hmm. three of them at the same point, we call it a, like the chicken food, chicken food <laughs> things. That's not good. That's not good. Not be not be not beautiful, right? <laughs> not beautiful. But not when you do like the subconscious, you do things, you know, like that. Sometimes you do whoops. Oh there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it happens. Yeah. It happens. Uh, it happens. Um uh see if you always without looking you um close your eyes i do not think you can avoid this happen <laughs> i don't i don't think so i don't think so mm. so you just you you, you 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 see that try to try to um control where your brush goes and of course, your eye you need to watch it. There is no secret to say how to how to avoid it. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. To control the the most things you can do is control your brush, and yeah. you 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 watch you watch it, and you know that in your mind. So try to try to avoid try you try to avoid it. It's possible. It's possible to avoid it. You know that kind of strokes is not appreciated. Because it looks very, you know, busy looking thing. Not yeah. Cute. Uh -huh. Thank you. Uh huh. I and just threw also, it away. <laughs> um, and also, uh, things. If you want to do something with the flower, um, with the with the with the pot there, or with some things, um, in the center, you can do things like the bouquet, bouquet, um, things. But if you want to do some things like on the, on the, on the cliff sometimes, you know, in the real uh, situation of the natural situation or beside the, uh, beside the something else, like, um, like a bigger rock thing, um, uh, sometimes you, you try to do um, like the one leaf or one stroke um, kind of, um, uh, dominate, dominate things will become beautiful. So some longer, some shorter, 
and uh, one like one one stroke um, dom dominate things if you want to do some things um, beside the things in the real situation. Uh, we will show more personality things for the orchids, if not just on the center of the table in the flower pot or in the vase, right? If in the real, like a natural situation. That's just, uh, you know, some feeling about that. I saw things, uh, Susan, on your uh, wall. There is the um, other um, orchid painting. I don't know what kind of a work, uh, orchid. Uh, see, shows some direction, right? Shows some direction, yeah. Not, um, you need to think of that. Not e exactly in the center and the left one, right one, flip, right? <laughs> that one shows very beautiful things. Yeah, even in the a kind of abstract, just the one things, only the orchids on the paper. You do some things, lean this side or that corner, you know, things and show some direction for that. Mm -hmm. Any questions? You enjoy to um, um, the orchid painting <laughs> and uh, yes. <laughs> um, I think it's very close to our uh, uh, calligraphy thing doing. Beautiful, Susan, I like it. Yeah, I, I like it, I like it. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, of course, yeah, I think uh, Susan does very well. One thing is the, um, the root part, naturally, um, any, any, any plants, root part need be uh, closer, right? Closer. And then uh, kind of the open the shape when it grow long. Beautiful, uh, Charlene, very beautiful, Charlene. I love it. I love it. I love it. And uh, they occupy the right, um, I mean, the right space, space and leave lots of uh, space, right place. Very, very good. I was going to ask you, we avoid the center or would yes. you, uh, uh, you totally avoid the center, even if you have calligraphy, correct? <laughs> You know, a lot, say if you had a lot of calligraphy, like what you wrote on the poem of uh, Confucius, you might need, actually, that would be bad if you had a center one too. Yeah, okay. Actually, I, I leave some space, my imagination <laughs> for the, uh, for, for this piece of orchid, you know, to do choo 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 until, <laughs> until I give some space. I do not want to uh, block the chi here. So even this part kind of spacey, but I think I tried off um, purposely uh, to uh, leave it uh, as it is. And, yeah, I like it. I yeah, like it. Yeah, yeah. I, I think you got it and you, and you did very good. I think um, even better than mine. I like your um, percentage of the, uh, the 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 stone, the rock, and the the you know occupy the smaller, smaller, leave more space. I like it, cause actually in the um, it, it needs a lot of air to uh -huh. to yeah to feel comfortable. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. I like it. Uh, what about you, Charles? Charles? Because <laughs> I, I, I know Charles got lots of, um, and a lot for a long time for the orchids painting. How are you, Charles? Cannot hear. <laughs> I'm here. Oh yeah, hi. <laughs> How are you doing? Good, good. Uh, yeah, I'm just having trouble finding where to turn the sound on. There it is in the bottom. Okay, no, no, no. Oh, oh, oh okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I saw you. Um, you can um do lots of things because um I'm just do some do do some things uh very basic about the calligraphy stroke because this uh orchestra is really good for uh, calligraphy stroke and uh, just extend some and become orchids and uh, uh, kind of, um, um, yeah, little ready painting, painting, drawing, whatever you call it. You can put color. I know some people, um, uh, some people uh, tell me um, 
like the um, uh, they just uh, they are on uh, tradition just uh, do do not like the black <laughs> some uh, East Asia East Asia play place uh huh I think you can do you you can do colorful things of course uh huh uh, yeah and uh, still. Uh, do some calligraphy. What about the calligraphy with the dark things to balance? And then when you put the uh, the red uh, the mood seal or name seal here, I said always said like the um, like the after the banquet a little bit of like a dessert, a sweet red one to balance the whole thing at the end. Eventually, a little bit of red one. Uh, if you and I, I didn't do very good about the different tones about the the ink one actually you can do uh that lighter ink for the flower petal you know light ink and the dryness and the wetness you know everything's uh, even for the ink we say green ink for two uh five colors right uh -huh. so Emily, how are you doing this was my first one i wasn't very happy with the rock <laughs> oh, oh uh, it, it's it's good. It's good. It's good. Yeah, you're right. You can do the flower. Uh, you can do the flower. Um, I mean, the colorful, colorful. Yes, of course. Uh huh. I I I, I like the, the 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 leaves are very um. I mean, the elegant and the the color of kind of a greenish and the light ink with the greenish things. Um, uh huh. Beautiful, beautiful. Mm -hmm. Very beautiful. Uh huh. And uh, um. So things about the I think uh, I uh, I mean but the, you do not have to think about the um, the the size about the the rock and the normally uh, how big how much how how much uh, I mean the size about the uh, the grass right because some people call this orchid is grass <laughs> it's a big grass a large grass uh -huh. uh, it, it is grass with beautiful flower but it's kind of the bigger. Um, and uh, um, but things uh, uh, since this is kind of kind of the uh, like Chinese orchid painting is abstract abstract painting. So some people even do that as larger than than the than the, than the tree. <laughs> so um, just thinking of things, uh, how big is good for your uh, piece of a paper arrangement? Yeah. That's the most things. Do not have to think about the the real things about the size. Yeah, think of or oh, probably oh, it's too big. It's occupied too you know too big on this paper. That's the important things for the whole image thing. But doesn't have to uh, think about the proportion uh, compare with the rock or the real. What kind of the bush, what kind of the grass, uh -huh. think of the image on your paper, uh -huh. occupy, you know, negative or positive space of that. How are you, Kathy? Good. And, okay, okay, I'm yeah. Experiment. Um, I'm experimenting. Good, good, good. Yeah, I, I, I like you always do experimenting on uh, different <laughs> paper and, uh, you know, put different color uh, arrangement to do things. Yeah. Um, as far as you have uh, um, interest in that, you know, feel good to um, practice that for making things of that for doing that. I think that's the most uh, things for me, you know, I want to do that the process. I really enjoy. Uh, I really enjoy it. That that things I like. I like the time uh, to do that. And uh, 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 yes. <laughs> okay. And uh, uh, yeah. Put the calligraphy on that. Just started to do that. And as topic, um, you can do uh, a little bit bigger like that at one character, two characters. Uh, some people or later on like the phrase with like the more than 10 uh, characters, you can do you know, smaller, smaller things or arrangement um, or put some people even put the, the different places, different, different places. But I think um, for the very basic and the traditional things try to do um, put and one one place that's start here yeah 
one place and put on the some things you think you want to uh you think you want to put and um yeah I like the Chinese questions it's talking about the where uh, to leave space and uh, uh, where to put things, uh, avoid the center of things, and how do I avoid it? Um, you know, not just a, that's the technique um, to let something uh, they really need space, you know, to grow, to show. And uh, I do not think that's the uh, very spacey uh, place. I think that's the golden place to leave it blank. Uh -huh. uh, do like that. Uh -huh. Kathy, show us. <laughs> 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 See, we're all, we are all learning things. Good, good, uh, good, good. Well, good, good. Uh, good. Uh -huh. Yes, 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 yes. And the try that, to, yeah. And the try these to. Were just, these good, I good. was just messing around. That one. Yeah, try was, to, yeah, yeah. After doing that, yeah, I like the rock thing. The rock, uh, the, the small hill things. Uh -huh. I like it. And I need to some, you know, not very, not the, not on the big mountain, big rocky mountain, uh, big uh, uh, axe cut mountain, because it needs some moisture there. Uh, I need a little bit of moisture to grow, right? It's a plant. <laughs> so uh, put these uh, things very basically reasonable. <laughs> uh, need some more, more moisture things. They put some moss dot there are possible or put some other grass things. Uh -huh. And uh, I still, Victoria, I yes. still find it difficult to load the brush correctly so that, you know, the, the uh, orchid is lighter in ink and do I have too much water, too little water, you know. One thing, a, uh, yeah, I understand. One thing actually um, you try to avoid is when you, we say wet the brush first, right? See my water basin? Yes. Okay, water the brush first, thoroughly wet it. Otherwise, um, the color or the ink won't kind of get on. And, but after that, you need to kind of dry it. Right. Yeah. I would say lots of, lots of people doesn't do that very uh, I mean, good enough. You, how do you do that? You tap this like this way to kind of let it self, self squeeze out the extra water. Yeah. Um, and then you even try to try to do like the, some waste absorbent paper or easiest way is the paper towel. Right. Into the paper towel mm -hmm, to get rid of even this dry. Yeah, yeah, but it's different, different uh, from the um, before dip in the water, like the air dry, the very dry, like your hair, not like that dry, you know, but very dry. And then you get into the ink. Otherwise, you will get the smearing ink. Right. Yeah. Right. Or um, on the color, sometimes probably you do not need to do that. But I think the color things you got got used to it. You go with west painting same way. You need to, you know, to uh, I mean to after the dip in the water, you need to um, wet it. You need to dry it. Otherwise, you put on a flower petal. It's smeared. Right. It's smeared. Right. Yeah. Even uh, on the size of paper, it's not smeared and not absorbent. But you know the the um, the color. Um, as a float, <laughs> right? Yeah. So you need to you, you need to get uh, get very uh, dry and then get ink or 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 water. Uh, I mean, or color. Uh -huh. Thank you. Uh -huh. And the, when you get the color or get the ink, uh, you 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 can try. You try on right. other uh, waste paper, painting the paper. You always have this kind of things. <laughs> beside you, yeah, you try it. 
and then you put on the place you want to do the real painting. You try to, mm, too light, mm, too dark, you know, you adjust a little bit, you can do that. Right. Okay, um, I think I, um, you, when you do homework, home, homework, you practice the characters and also you do the um, orchestra painting. You can do yourselves, you know, depends on the things. You do not have to copy mine. Uh, uh, you need to, um, you know, you do things you want to do, but based on the, the stroke, the techniques for the stroke arrangement, the three strokes. Um, and also we talked about uh, uh, the, the root part, in the root part, a little bit like, you know, this kind, this kind of the shape, like the wish the uh, fish, fish head, you know, fish head, this kind of the things, like a gathered, the center gathered like that. Understand? Like the mm -hmm. fish head, fish head things, yeah. Not like the, um, like the very flat, very horizontal line there. Uh, um, but not to squeeze at the one point. Um, trying to get together, together, thinking of uh, underneath of the um, earth, they are share the same root, you know, same plants. But the whole shape, kind of the fish head shape like that. And then, you know, open to spread some things when you to grow taller. Yeah, and uh, do yourself things, you know, together with other flower is also possible, or you just want to practice this, fine, yeah. And uh, if any any questions, let me know, or any um, any your um, experiment <laughs> you want to uh, show me, uh, you're more than more than welcome. I like to see that. Um, basically, I, I do lots of uh, um, experiments as well, and, uh, I practice that. I just I enjoy I enjoy the work of doing that. So uh, I want to something uh, some people do that together with me and uh, same things <laughs> we do together. Uh -huh. Question. Yes, Shani. Um, is the number four uh -huh. something we should avoid in Chinese? Uh, you, you know the I don't know if that's feng shui or maybe that's Japanese. Mm -hmm. But I know that when you go to buy a teacup set mm. in, J J you know, a, a Japanese shop, mm -hmm. you have three teacups mm -hmm. or five. Mm -hmm. And I was wondering if in Chinese, you know, the number four is the same thing and you shouldn't have four petals or, you know, four flowers, you should either have three or five. Uh -huh. The phonetic thing, yeah, the phonetic things, because uh, um, this is the number of the, four. Right. Uh -huh. And uh, um, pronounce as uh, si. And also um, the, we have other, other word of die. Oh, I see. Um, same, very close to pronounce with a different tone. Um, this is the fourth tone. Um, I mean, this is the third tone. Si. <laughs> and this is the fourth tone. Like a si. uh, So, um, but very, uh, very uh, close to the sound for that. So people try to um, avoid the things you have the uh, sounds like that. I do not like. I try to avoid that. That's why some people say the, the like Chinese like New Year's Day. Uh, uh, grandmother, grandmother always tell traditionally always tell the uh, little children, little children, uh, and say, do not mention the wor any word of the 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 si. The si, okay. If you remember that, that's not 
not good will bring bad luck. People do not want to think of these things in the uh, important day, you know, um, the um, wedding day, the uh, Chinese New Year day, or some um, um, elder, elder people's uh, birthday, do not say anything about this, uh, the things of si, okay, the die, okay. Remember that, remember, okay. Remember, ha, huh? seriously, if you can remember it, um, I will give you, you know, candy, you will get candy. Otherwise, you cannot get candy, okay? Oh, okay. <laughs> and uh, until afternoon, until afternoon, uh, kiss to grandmother. Grandmother, grandma, grandma, I'm good child, see? I didn't say any die. <laughs> <laughs> so it's boom. <laughs> oh, so <laughs> that's the joke. Very common, common, common joke. It's just just some um uh say it's, it's not um as features or some things so just to try to say uh do not want the bad luck uh of things you can because uh, with the uh, share the same kind of sound uh -huh. but for um other other word of uh, persimmon persimmons we have that uh, they, that sound as the um, royal tone say the shh, and uh, um, for southern uh, southern people doesn't distinguish the tell the difference. Also pronounce as si, si. Uh, So um, also people people use this uh, uh, shi or si, um, so um, draw some persimmon persimmon in the New Year's Day in the New Year's Day. Other word things or matter with the same uh, phonetic sound for that. This is a shi or southern people call it a si <laughs> as well. Mm -hmm. So with the same thing about the uh, things or matters or um, you know um, um, any subject. So everything is good we also call the uh, shi ru yi. So things, things, very good. So people also doesn't mind this kind of the uh, the sound for the fourth. People uh, draw um, the four persimmons. Four persimmons indicated everything everything um, goes well. So wish you better, wish you new year, everything goes very well. So people also use this, the number four, number four things with the same sound about the everything. So four, four, like the four um, persimmons, painting the four persimmons for new year's wish. So wish you um, everything next year growth well, growth well, well, and it goes very well. So there is taboo and there is wish all for the phonetic things. Yeah, I mean the reason I explain. <laughs> but for the, you know, I really um, appreciate that because uh, you know I've never had it explained that way, and I really like that. Mm -hmm. you know, it makes mm -hmm. a lot of sense. Makes a lot of sense, yeah. But yeah. for um for the uh like uh, uh four gentlemen, four gentlemen, uh we always say four gentlemen, not say oh four is not good. No, never, never. Uh huh. So I make a splendor for some occasion, like a four, we try to um, avoid like a New Year's year. Uh, some people can think old people, elder people, you know, they're afraid of people mentioned the word of uh, 
doesn't want to listen to the die things <laughs> and uh, uh, they think mm, try to avoid that but they also appreciate like the four persimmons sounds sounds like the everything goes well goes well um, bad, um, uh, better very good beautiful wishes for you good wishes for you uh -huh. best wishes for you also like the poor four um, I mean, persimmons painting as the gift painting. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, not every, not every, not everywhere, not everywhere um, for these uh, four things. Well, some people, you know, um, they like, uh, um, they like the, they do not like the four in the, even the, like the car and, and DMV, the car. Car number, car number. Uh -huh. They say some things. They try to avoid uh, uh, number four or some things that they like the six. They like the eight. It all depends. Uh -huh. Chinese people like eight. And why like do they eight. like eight? Um, also, the um, the, um, the uh, phonetic thing, because the eight um, uh, ba. Is the sound uh, most uh, very close to the the Cantonese uh, things about the the fa? Uh, how to say like the business goes where and uh, become richer. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, uh -huh. okay. Okay, I think um, today's class. Um, it's over and uh, um, let you go. Um, unless you have a question, I can answer. Um, and uh, see you next time. Next time, And next time, I'm pretty sure my orchestra is blooming and we'll do some colorful. I'm, 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 I'm interested in this. It's a kind of the um, uh, different from the Master Seas Garden, uh, the basic, the five petals of the uh, orchids. So different orchids, that's why uh, many times I will do bring it to the class. The flower part, uh, besides the leaf part, uh, narrow or um, some curvy, some straight, beside that, the flower part are different. So this, this flower are different with more than five petals. By the way, the five petals, I think one student called, well, I, I, I wrote the, my um, uh, the suggestion. The flower pad is like the, your, see your, fing, ping, uh, uh, your fingers. The three is outside, three petals are outside and the two kind of uh, inner layer um, is um, front towards, um, towards uh, ahead towards a head, uh, it's like the, we call it embracing, embracing arming, embracing pedal. It's like that. So do like that. If you side, if you see the side, it's like that. Okay. Yeah, if you do the um, face to you, it's ca you cannot, you can, you can see, you cannot really see the five, always see like, you know, like, like the two very small one for this because of its uh, front to us, yeah. And uh, only see three of them. So, but you try to do things abstract, not the real real flower, you know, the bio or teaching book, not like that. But try to understand some things like that, five mm -hmm. petals normally, yeah. Very good. <laughs> okay, thank you. And no. Sorry about the, the interrupt. Yeah, and uh, we try to uh, next time. I don't know. Try to avoid that, but ca if cannot avoid, uh, just remember um, if you uh, find you off uh, off the class and you need to um, re log in again. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you for your patience and sorry about the Thank time. You. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank Bye. You. Bye. Bye.